There are millions of lead water pipes going to people's homes across the country. A new federal rule could mean those pipes are replaced in 10 years. Phil Miston takes a look at how this change could impact the city of Milwaukee's efforts. As the EPA and the Biden administration put forward new rules that could require cities to replace lead pipes, the city of Milwaukee continues its own efforts block by block. Over at the Zeidler building in the waterworks department. We've been replacing services for, the, for nearly seven years now um, and have feel like we've gotten pretty good at it. Superintendent Patrick Pauley says it was estimated only a few years ago replacing all of the city's lead service lines would take 60 years. But the federal government's $15 billion infrastructure plan changed that. It was the first time that funding was allocated specifically to lead service line replacement. Mayor Kevlar Johnson called for lines to be replaced in 20 years, focusing on disadvantaged communities most at risk. The city's replaced about 6,400 lead service lines since 2017, about 1,200 for 2023. The goal is to increase that number to 2,200 lines replaced in 2024 as part of the 20-year plan. But the EPA's proposed rule change would essentially cut that time frame in half from 20 years to 10 years. This proposed rule will force us to adjust even further and expand more aggressively. There are about 65,000 residential lead service lines in Milwaukee, an estimated 9 million across the country. If approved, the rule would be a daunting task for cities, as some don't know where they are. For Milwaukee, Pauly says the city's in a good position, even with a possibly compressed timeline. But Pauly says one question will be if there will be enough contractors to do the work if and when other cities start the replacement process as well. In Milwaukee, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News.